same myth. Stay down. I hear people say that all the time. And coaches are right to say stay down, but it's, it has to be clarified. Stay down with your eyes, stay down with your head. Many times what happens is the players will sneak a peek because the brain is ahead of the hand. But what you want to do is lift with your body. Does that mean every time a tennis player hits a tennis ball they're going to lift? No, but for the most part when you're just in that baseline exchange, you're going to lift on ground strokes. You don't want to end up looking like Groucho Marx where you go across the stage and you're staying down like this. Tennis players, by the time they're hit, the top players, you'll see how they uncoil to the point where they're airborne. Once again, top spin is a downward motion. It's created with an upward motion of the body and racket. So for the ball to spin down, the racket and body go up. So it's the eyes and head that stay down, but the body actually lifts. Say, for example, if I was driving off the front foot, I want to have this front leg snap straight right before the hit so that energy transfers into the shot. Many times you'll see kids that have been told to stay down. They'll stay down, and then they lift up after the hit, and that energy doesn't transfer to the shot. So then what happens is they hit the ball slower, they hit the ball with less spin, hit the ball lower than that, they end up making mistakes or hitting short. So with ground strokes, stay down with your eyes and your head, but you lift up with your body.